Hey Mod Runners, um, welcome back for the final episode of Modern Man, or at least the final weekly episode of Modern Man. Um, uh, today's episode is basically just a kind of a, a year in review. Um, it's been now one year since I started doing the channel and I just felt like it was good to kind of go through. I have a list of all the different episodes that I've gone through and I have a very delicious wine. Uh, we might as well start off with the wine. Um, today I am drinking uh, one of my uh, favorite wineries up in Santa Barbara. You can actually see one of the videos right here uh, from the wine trip that I did up in Santa Barbara. This is the Fontes and Phillips. Uh, this is their uh, Shelby's Syrah 2011. Um, I just opened it up. Um, it's still a little young. It's a 2011 and obviously it's 2014 now. Um, this one can mature just a little bit longer, but it's still really, really good. Um, It's very berry. It's still got a little bit of um, oakiness to it. Um, I don't have this. this uh, I don't have the statistics. I swear this is all I've had. Um, I don't have the statistics on um, on the details, how long it's been in the barrels or anything like that. But um, I just felt like uh, having a glass of wine while I kind of went through the uh, the episodes. Uh, basically, uh, today's episode is the, like I said, it's a review. I'm um, talking about a few of the episodes and where I've come from over the last year. Um, it started off with the intro here and the kind of silliness that came about. Um, I created this channel so that I could share the passions that I love. Um, wine and photography. Um, but what really took off uh, with this, what uh, struck a chord with all of you was the uh, was the costume, uh, the How to Train Your Dragon costume. Uh, that is what really kind of uh, created all the subscribers and the followers. Um, I have close to 500 subscribers now. Thank you all for everybody who's subscribed to the channel, who's shared the videos, who's given me the thumbs up and and written all the really nice comments that you said about the costume and all the other things. I really do appreciate it. It was an experiment. Um, see if I could do something once a week and create a channel based on the passion. Um, I had hoped that I, I would get more people commenting about their own passions, uh, things that they've gotten excited about, but I know that the costume itself uh, you guys really, really enjoyed. Um, I'm glad that they were helpful. Um, I do promise I will put out um, the last little bit of the costume stuff like the pants and anything else, but I'm not going to be doing it on a weekly basis anymore. This is kind of it for a while. Um, you know, I'm getting ready to move and, you know, changing work and jobs and things like that. So um, I'm probably not going to. I know for certain I'm not going to put out a video every week. I might put out maybe one once a month. I'm not really sure. And of course, if I ever create a new costume and people want to see it, I'll, I'll do that for you. But um, please continue to like the videos. Please continue to share. Go through some of the older ones. Um, this one here uh, was the Octomask, uh, which uh, had the GoPro attachment on it. Uh, so if those scuba divers out there, if you're looking right now, right before Christmas, Christmas is in two days, um, or when you're watching this video, Christmas was yesterday, because um, I put out the videos every Friday, but I record them a couple days earlier. Uh, the Octomask, great, great uh, mask for putting your GoPro on. Um, some of the other ones that I had uh, that I thought were really kind of fun. Um, the Oscar special. Uh, right now, uh, it's the season for the, the movies coming out. And the, uh, uh, the, the award ceremonies are going to be starting, so everybody's voting right now. So the Oscar ceremony, was, uh, which was a lot of fun, which was right here. Uh, Prediction-wise, I got, I think, 22 out of 24, so not, not too bad. Um, what other ones that I have that were really kind of fun? Um, the wetsuits episode for the scuba diving, um, you can find right here. Um, that was a kind of cool. Um, I don't know. I got an accent kind of going on there. I don't know where that came from. Must be the wine. Um, the Comic Con, Comic Con Live. Uh, that was a fun one. That's where. You know, Hiccup kind of talks like this a little bit, and he kind of a little bit nasally, but it's a little bit more in the back of the throat. And 
Oh my goodness, this is amazing! I mean, that's kind of how that kind of character came about and walking down the stairs or taking the escalator down. That was the Comic-Con live. Um, what else ones I have? Um, a couple of wine episodes. I had the Walt Wine Review, uh, which was I'll put up right here. And of course, you can always go through and you can click on the on the the videos from the past. I do encourage you now that I have a bunch of new subscribers to go through some of the older videos and and click on them and take a look and and once again click on the ads. Um, what else do I have here? You already seen all the, uh, the How to Train Your Dragon costumes, so those ones you can find on yourself. Um, I do want to say that the, the uh, making of the helmet, uh, two-part episode, that one was probably my most favorite to make because it was the most frustrating costume of all the Hiccups costumes that I made was the, the helmet. It was the most frustrating um, trying to figure out the shape and how I was going to stitch it together and create the, uh, the molds for the, the dragon uh, scales along the ridges there. So that episode was probably, in terms of my favorite, uh, those ones there because the, the helmet was the most difficult out of all the costume stuff that I made. Um, what else do I have? Some of the older ones. Um, the fin strap holder, um, I'll put up right here. Uh, that one was fun because um, it really is one of my most favorite pieces of gear. Um, it's not very expensive, it's like 20 bucks. And it holds my mask for when I'm going through the surf and my fins for when I'm walking down the stairs. So um, that one, I think I said I'd put it up right here, um, was a lot of fun. Um, what other ones? Um, I guess that's kind of it, the kind of the ones that I wanted to talk about. Um, once again, it was basically just a big thank you to everybody for subscribing to the channel, watching the videos over the past year. Um, I can't believe it's been a year since I first walked through the TARDIS and, uh, and created this channel. Um, it just it blows my mind. Um, you've all been uh, a lot of support. I'm, I'm so grateful, so thankful for um, all, the, all the kind words that everybody said. Um, I'm going to take one more sip of my wine. It's got a lot of flavor to it, so it makes me, makes me really happy. So, again, thank you, everybody. Um, just because I'm not going to be putting out a video every week, um, just know that I'm really appreciative of all of you out there. Um, I'm hoping that I've inspired, you know, somebody out there that to, to make their own costume or or get excited about the world around us. I'm kind of getting a little, kind of, you know, thinking about um, the year, so I'm getting a little, you know, verklempt up here. Um, but uh, thank you, everybody. Have a great uh, Christmas holiday season. Happy New Year to everybody out there. And uh, thank you for watching. No matter what it is you're going out there and doing, creating costumes, enjoying wine, taking photography, pictures, please share your passions with everybody else. And no matter what it is you're going out there and you're doing, find your passion.